right thingy there. Oh, yeah. yeah. And then there's some dots at the side for you, isn't there? Oh, look at you. There you go. Got it. Thank you. <coughs> All right, got it. Right, try that again. Let me try that again. All right, here she comes. Babes, just don't worry about all these people that I'm making friends with and that. It's all part of my master plan. I'm going to be bigger than all of these people. Obviously, I can't be bigger than Elfbear. She's too young for it and all that. But by, yeah. by, by linking up with all these people, it's only going to benefit my platform. You know what I mean? I wouldn't be doing any of this if it didn't benefit me. Like, I'm not silly. Obviously, I'm not going to allow anybody to be main character vibes over me. You know, they respect me at the end of the day. So I don't know why. Like, but I seem to have this way with people that they want to be around me. So I'm going to use that to my advantage this year. I'm not getting no fellas. I'm happy my relationship's over. You know, and I'm just going to absolutely keep going for it. So, but the thing, good thing about me is you never know what I'm gonna do next. You really don't. So um, I don't even know what I'm gonna do next. <laughs> but no, I'm not letting anybody. I'm not linking up with anybody who's gonna take over me. There's no way. I'm gonna keep doing what I'm doing, and it doesn't matter if I'm friends with you. Like I, I like just like Alphabet, I still say things about it. Of, you know what I mean? Like I'm not changing my FIP. If people want to be my friends, but accept what I do. You know what I mean? Yeah, good. No, you're, st you're still you're still fair with Alphabet when you do your FIP. Even when she's in the chat, you're still fair and you still criticise. So nothing nothing's changed there, and that, that's clear. Isn't yeah, it? I don't want people to think just because I'm being pally with people that I'm going to change what I'm doing. It's working for me. Do you think I'm going to water down my platform for, for anybody else's ego? No way. If you want to be my friend, I'll be the best friend in the world. But if you want to be my enemy, then so be it. It's entertaining either way, though, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. What did, you, what did you think when you seen the the CLA tonight when I linked up in the in the chat? I wasn't. I wasn't watching. Uh, we was. We was live. We got told. I had to give it a hundred and seventy pound gift first. <laughs> did you? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. How's it? I did have to do chase though because I knew she. I knew then she'd be like, oh, okay. So she's real about the friendship. <laughs> yeah, do you know me. Me goal with CLA is to try and like you know bring her back down to earth a bit because like, at the moment she she's not doing. She, as, she she may think she's got all this money in the bank. She's doing all these good things, but she's not. She's absolutely alienating so many different people. You know what I mean? Like and and she was more more grounded and humble when she had somebody around her. You know who was like you know a bit more level headed. Yeah, she's been isolated for ages, hasn't she? She's oh, not been involved not in any of the big stuff. at all. No, she's not. She's not. She's been left out. Yeah. So she's got no inclusion and like there's nobody to be around and to go out with or do anything or to hook up with anymore, you know what I mean? Yep. I agree. So it's, it's going to be fun times ahead then, is that what you're saying? Yeah, but I, I, that's what I'm trying to say. I want to get across to you because I know you is super invested and stuff, you like me. But like I wanted to let you know that don't be thinking that I'm going to like water down my thing that I'm doing now because it's going so well for just to be friends, you know what I mean? I do want to meet up with Chelsea, yeah, but like if that mean, if that's a, co a cost of her saying she's better than me all the time, and I'll, I'll show her who's better than him, you know what I mean? Yep, yes. <laughs> 100%. No. <laughs> So I'm, I'm, I, the difference with me is I've got longevity because I'm evolving with the app. She's pretty much stuck at a stalemate at the moment. Yeah, I agree with that. I, and the, the way you've changed your style now and the FYP style you're doing, the computer-based style, how are you finding that? How are you finding using a camera and not talking to a phone? Amazing. I much prefer it. No, I couldn't imagine speaking to my phone no more. You know what I mean? It's absolutely so amazing. I can't, I don't get why people are still engaging in these battles. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, gift you create for, for doing a good job. Why are people gifting? Come on, everyone, give me a rose, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Why? It's, them days are gone, are gone. Why are people still engaging? I don't know. It's not entertaining at all to see people battling. You're giving them your money, what for? For sitting there going, come on, guys. Agreed. Yep. That's what we say. Yeah, basically. And so, is, is it quite an easy setup then? Like, so switching from the phone to doing um, gaming and stuff and doing your FYP on that. So is it quite an easy setup? Because most people do it if they really tried. I think we're, well, because I'm not, I, I was never a gamer or anything like that. I played Bomberman or Mario Kart, my brother, when I was growing up or whatever, but I wasn't a gamer. And then obviously, when I got the old gaming set up, um, I, was doing, I started the Evil Queen thing tonight in lockdown. And uh, I invested like £7,000 of the money into a gaming setup because I got a contract with Facebook Gaming. I thought that was going to be the next big, massive thing. <laughs> obviously, it didn't transpire. But I had all the equipment and I've had it for ages. And I always said, I'd love to do like a, a sort of thing that misread does, but obviously I was still doing the Evil Queen at the time, and obviously then the rules on the app changed. And I have to think on my feet, you, you, there's so many different eras to me if you look back. You know, I, I've constantly got to move for the times, otherwise, you know, I'll be finished. And it's my only source of income, you know, at the end of the day. So, no, no that's good, though. and that's good that you've got the ability to move for the times, and you know, that's that shows. And the, the observer was bigging you up there saying how good, you know, your FYP show is going. And... It's, it's, it's growing, isn't it? I, 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 and see, the thing is, I, I do obviously like, I, I know I'm getting the good numbers and everything. I just hope it, it is entertaining and it's not just putting my speakers and getting more views every day. Yeah, no, it is entertaining because a lot of people, again, missing stuff and some people need to be in the loop and want to be in the loop. So they're going to find an FYP show where they're going to settle into and, and they know that they know that you're going to give like a non-biased opinion on, on what you're watching. And I think that's what people value. 
Hi, Cathy. Do, well, do, 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 you know, do you know why I've changed it to eight o'clock? Did you see not see Icecock yesterday? Oh my God, love. I got so many more viewers, so many more. It's like the four o'clock. People are just getting the kids in. They're not really, they can't really dedicate, but eight o'clock, you know what I mean? And I swear I've got, I've doubled my subscription, doubled my income. You know what I mean? That's just by literally changing from four to eight. That's really good, isn't it? Yeah, I'm honest. You see, I think people value me a bit more because I'm, I'm honest. I'll say I'm doing well and what I'm, what I'm, what I'm making, and I'll be grateful and everything. You know what I mean? Because uh, my goal, is, yeah, my goals this year now that obviously I'm, on, I'm on my own and I'm not tied up to anybody else's emotions because my head and my heart. I always go on about this are two different things. I'm very logical thinking. I'm very on the ball. Even when I know I, I'm still aware, you know, but I try and make things work. But I've noticed that when I'm in a relationship, I focus on the other person more than myself. So I prioritize them, their feelings, their emotions, and I sideline myself, and I end up sad. You know. Know what I mean like I end up not performing the way I should you know because obviously like I'm, I'm affected in the real life and stuff and I've, and I've noticed when I am just on my own and doing me I flourish so much better I really do so much so many more things that like are, are good and and it and help me rather than anybody else you know what I mean so uh, this year is about me and you know obviously I want to have a good fucking sex life this year you know what I mean I'll fucking like have some little hookups and stuff but I don't want a boyfriend because I literally just I, you know what I mean that can come in the future but I need to work on on my my platform and everything and you know, like I say, I know you're saying I didn't fall off, but I didn't fall off. No, I've still got my popularity, but I was on holiday. I was prioritizing other things, you know what I mean? And, I don't, and I've got to remember that this is my life and I need to be the number one in it. And I'm not when I'm in a relationship because I make them my priority, but they don't even make me their priority. So why the fuck should I? So I need to be selfish this year. Exactly. Now you're smashing it. Absolutely smashing it. Enjoy saying there, 2024, the year of the queen. But look at all yous that I've got, like, who, who actually like me, and, like, yous are decent people, genuine people, you know, like, yous aren't on trolls, you, you do things out of creativity and everything, and I have really good, decent people following me. You you look at my chat compared to anybody else, I've said the most heinous, terrible things, and, I, and everyone's loving me off, you know what I mean? I don't know what it is, I'd, I'd, I'd love, my dad always used to say, oh, you're very endearing, you know what I mean, type of thing, but I don't know why people, like, are drawn to me, I'd love to know what the little recipe is, type of thing. You are, you know, you, you actually are, that's quite a good word to use, because you are. I'd love to, but I, you know, I, I like to know the ins and outs of everything. So I, I'd love to know what the secret was myself because I'd fucking bottle in the cell. <laughs> it's quite like, you know, when you say something and even when you're, you know, even when you used to say really brutal things, it's kind of still like, it, it, to me, I was never offended by anything, but it was kind of like, there's almost a cheekiness behind it where you're like, gosh, she's, she's really said that. Well, I didn't actually enjoy doing all that. It was just because I, it made me money, you know what I mean, obviously. <clears throat> but I know, I'm so glad to be away from it because I'm not getting any grief now, and I, you know what I mean? And, and, and it, it like never bothered me all that because I knew that I was just doing an act or whatever. And you must admit, the creators must agree with that because look what I said about DC Dector and now he plays Fortnite with me. If these people really believed that I was this heinous person saying all these terrible things, these people would not speak to me, and I know that. So I'm actually happy that people can see there's a difference from the act that I was doing. Now the rules have changed. I can be me myself and, I, and I've found something that I'm enjoying to do. You know, I love chatting. Sorry, I pressed the wrong button. I can bloody uh, sit there for six hours now and chat to everybody. Thank you, Nick. And chat to everybody and I'm much more enjoying the app. I really am. Good. Uh, that's, that's really nice. That. That's, and, and of course, we're all enjoying the um, the new style and a lot of people changing over to this 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 style and, and playing games. Yeah, like I started uh, it off, didn't I? All of a sudden, everyone's got this, that and the other. I'm always yeah. like a ringleader. It's funny. <laughs> 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 oh, well, I promise that. I'm not going to change as a person. It doesn't matter who I'm friends with. If they want to be friends with me, they've got to set my, my, my what I'm doing on the app. You know what I mean? Like, obviously, like the only thing Alphabet's asked me not to do is Miss Jen's. I've agreed to that. You know what I mean? Like, I actually got on with Alphabet. Funnily enough, you may think, "Wow, what a weird combination." But she's actually all right. Like, I speak to her offline. Like, she sends me videos, voice messages me. Like, I've been chatting with her and that. But um, I'm not taking anybody's shit though. I'm not. I, if they, if they, uh, you know what I mean? One thing she asked me not to do, I won't do. But like, I'm gonna like do my entertainment on the app like they sit and burp and do all this eating loud and this that, and that's their form of entertainment so they've got to accept mine too and i don't care you know you know what like i, I want to be back friends with cla i think it'll be amazing content i'm looking at it like that well, i did get on with there you know what i mean we did have a ball going to these place that place and it was always entertaining so i'm looking at it from that standpoint but if she wants to say she's better than me and this that and the other she began told where to go you know what i mean God, that's how you do it. Yeah, I, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm, at the end of the day, I'm racking in over 2,000 people on my show, and I don't need anybody else. I want to be around people, but I don't need them, and that's the good thing about it. Good. And they can't call me a cloud chaser, this, that, and the other, because they're my views, my opinions, you know what I mean? I'm not playing people's videos saying, oh, look at this, and just saying nothing. I'm giving an in-depth opinion. It takes me hours to speak on it all, and people want to hear what I've got to say, clearly. No, clearly, and you're not just a randomer doing that. You're, you're evil queen doing that, and that's, that's the value. Yeah, and I come from day dot, really. I'm not like, you know what I mean? A lot of these people, I really wish they were like I've, all of you in the box. You must admit these battles need to stop, don't you? Unless you provide an entertainment. What are these people paying for these battles for? 
No, I, I don't get it. We, we don't do battles. We don't no, do anything like that. No, I friendships doing little battles and stuff while you're just chilling and that, babe. But I'm saying, like, the likes of these box battles, what is anybody actually getting out of it? They're all muted in Diadro's box. So I'm not talking about little mates who will have a little battle or whatever, but these people who are offering themselves up as massive creators on here, what are you exactly creating apart from taking everybody's cash? Cash, that's what it is, isn't it? Hard cash. Mm-hmm. That's, it gets to a stage where, like you say, you turn your camera off, you go on mute, head down, and you just sit there and earn cash. Babes, listen, some of them don't even have the face on the camera. They've got a picture and they're still getting gifted. And I'm like, how the fuck are you getting a universe, please? You haven't even got your face on the camera. You're not even muted. Yeah. What the hell's going on? So I'm not slagging people off who battle as friends, who do actually provide entertainment and shit. But these people who literally come on just to battle and there's people support them, I don't get it. One don't bit. get it. No, it's, that's content, apparently. That's, um, that's, that's the way it's gone. Don't get it. It's, just, it's, it's bizarre behaviour. Mm. It's well bizarre. Exactly, and so now I believe everybody should be offering something. To look at you sitting doing your drawings and that, you know what I mean? And if people come in and say, oh, who's this? Oh, that's amazing. And Maria, blah, blah, you've got content. You're providing, Joey Tiki, providing content. Content creators, live streamers, providing content. Doesn't matter what you're doing, but you should, thank you, everybody. It, you, but you shouldn't be sitting there, I don't believe, in this 2024 now. Yes, that was the way the app was, and everyone was battling and everything. But now I think people need to be putting content on. Yeah, no, we, we say exactly the same. And like, you know, in our small art community, we come on nearly every day for hours, you know, sometimes like seven hours alive. And we just do pure art. We talk about all the stuff on the art. We talk about the FYP, but always on the screen, we're doing something visual. And, you know, we've got, we've got a great, a great art community where, you know, we, there's no one coming in like trauma dumping. We don't, there's no one coming in like trying to take over the chats or anything like that. It's all controlled. Until I come in. <laughs> until, you, yeah, until you come in trying to, trying to take all the clout from the art community. <laughs> How dare you? Please, everybody, follow follow these people as well. If, obviously, the, these are the ones who create all the artwork, the skits, especially Nostrils and Co. and everything. And, and like Joey Tickies in the chat as well. And we need to be supporting people like this, I believe. You know, we're actually putting content out there. And st- but every, I know everyone loves the drama, but sometimes there's not even drama going on. And somebody's got, like, for instance, CLA will have 2.7 thousand people. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> it's madness right and and you know and obviously now it's going to move forward a bit tell her to do some more art on live please get, yeah, get her doing I, some I, I, I sent, I sent, she did say to me like when i went in the box she was like oh i did try and call you but i thought with hell i've got all that denied i can remember i leaked my number when i was showing an inbox one time but i kept the same yeah. number because obviously I'm in this day and age technology you can just nobody can get through to you even if they've got your number you know what i mean so i still managed to keep my number so i sent her it again and obviously i'll have a chat with her and stuff but like i i do believe that chelsea has become isolated because she's she's swirling down this bloody whale pool of i don't know she's lost mm-hmm. i think you know what i mean and she's got no she hasn't got no people that she's really close to and we mean her used to be close you know and, and and i think it'll be good content if we go on holiday just together we've never actually done that together we've been to cornwall yeah but not to a foreign country without men without anything like that you know i think the content that we can create even if we don't have to be the best of friends we do get on and everything and we are and, and like i think everything will be all right but um she she knows herself she's not stupid me and her creating content together and stuff and doing this that and the other and like i did say so would you not meet up with alpha but maria again imagine all four of us you know what i mean she was like oh, oh yeah wow. imagine that I want to bring content to this app, and you know what I mean. If I can be the ringleader and start getting people around each other, like to just like you need to look at it like it's entertainment. Yeah, it is entertainment. The winner, that's what it is. Miss Real big up, Gen Z and all big up. No, it is so. It's entertainment, and someone's got to do it. Because, like you say, someone's got to drag her out of isolation, yeah. and someone's got to provide good content for people to follow. And you know, you know how to do it. If anyone knows how to do it, God, I'm not to survive loving these climates. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> now I'd be fucking destitute without the this app. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I spent 70 grand last year. I need to get that back. Jeez, how, how do you do that? Jesus Christ. You don't notice, babe, but you know when you, do you know when like you think to yourself, right, two and a half thousand pound flights to Thailand, all these hotels while we were there, that's another about two grand. And when you start working it out and everything that you've bought and the places yeah. that you've been. But the sad thing was all these lovely places that I went, I didn't enjoy none of it in reality, you know what I mean? Like I was like yeah. you know, I wasn't enjoying any of it. So I know now that I'm, I'm, and this year's gonna be my year, it really is. And I know people say that and all, but you know how determined I am once I get the bit between teeth you can tell how determined you are you, you can you can you can feel the energy coming coming across that's how determined you are i think we all know that yeah i'm determined to actually be be doing something for me rewards as well because I, i'm not having anybody turn around and say that i'm just like fucking milking people on this app or anything you know what i mean you know i've got really massive high level gift of friends you don't have to yeah. give me all the time not like that you know what i mean like I, I appreciate everything that they all do but i'd rather be little mates with them you know what i mean fucking hell uh, but i wish they would have built the gifts and badges with me <laughs> yeah. other people. i bet you they wish they would as well would have as well though you know what i mean Oh yeah, yeah. No, I, like I, I watch your FYP. You have your goals. You don't beg. 
you do you do what you do but you're providing content and that's you know there's nothing you know what it is as well i always find if you're nice to people as well in the situation and even when i was doing eva queen i was always nice to me people you know what i mean like and do you know what i do you know what i always do as well and, and you and if you've watched me for a long time on holidays when people meet me i always give them a hug and stuff i got that princess diana you know what i mean like i i, I understand that people like i i'm not like this is the thing people go oh fans but i have and i am building a fandom and i've had fans for years you know what i mean 10 years 15 years people go back to their farm and all that so i want to build on that and i want to build a really strong community i want to feel like you know everybody has got me back and they understand me as a person and you know for me being transgender as well to be doing all this and to be actually you know people do respect me and you you never hear them trying to disrespect my gender only trolls will do it you know people 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 actually do nod the head a bit to me and give me respect you know what i mean which is nice no i agree with that because most of the time on here when when the the, tra- the the transgender issue is talked about it's mainly talked about in a negative way people are arguing that the labels and this and that whereas with you you're, you're just you're just doing it you're just like you know f it all i'm just what they're gonna say to me that exactly yeah exactly <laughs> I've got everything. They're like, what can they do? Like, they see the, they see that men are interested in me. I live a normal life. I don't live a transgender life. I live a normal life, pretty much. You know what I mean? Like, and uh, I'm, I'm made up. That fucking fellas are after me and everything. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's a bit, bit, a bit compliment. You know, when you can get actually fully scal- the scalliest the lads in Liverpool. You know what I mean? Like, like taking you on dates and then you're like, fucking hell, you'll just accept me. It's, I love it. I love my little life. Okay. That's how it should be. You know, that's you know, that's how it should be. And if you're experiencing how it should be, then you know what, what a fantastic inspiration that is. Oh, well, I know what unhappiness feels like. I went through unhappiness last year. I had the Rickster prior to the Bradley one. You know what I mean? I've been through so much, like so much unhappiness and people will sit there and obviously like try to blame me. But then when you think about it, what did I actually do apart from provide a, provide a good life? I never put anything up on live about this, that and the other happening. It was always manipulated to make me look bad, you know? And obviously I took the, I took the blame a lot of the time for situations that I was never really in the blame for. It was just because obviously like, like I am good when in a relationship, but they, they take advantage of me, you know what I mean? And, and like how, how much I do like, you know what I mean? Become besotted and stuff like like that so they use it against me in the end type of thing and then try and ruin me but they can never ruin me that's what they need to understand you can make a video talking about me and it'll get two hundred thousand viewers but try and make a video talking on your own and you'll get two thousand views <laughs> exactly so even when the bradley one made that video about me how bad i am and it gets two hundred and fifty thousand views they're not his viewers i look at that like that's my viewers they're people who are watching about me they want to hear about me the good the bad the ugly they're not there for boring bradley or, or any other rickster or and anybody else who wants to chat about me they're there to see i wonder what your life's like behind the scenes and they're interested in me that's what you got to remember it's all me it's not off their own back they're not getting views because they're talking about themselves getting views because they're talking about me exactly big up maz and stays for using the exclusive nostrils and coal evil queen emotes in the chat (laughs) (laughs) exactly georgie and i've realized my worth and i know what i bring to any table i'm sat at you know what i mean so obviously people need to start matching me not the other way around i need to be stepping down people need to step their game up Joey is shouting out for merch in the chat. He really wants to know. I'm going to buy a t shirt press. I'm going to yes. make, make hoodies. You know what I mean? How much are they? Do, do you know nostrils? Oh, no idea. T shirt press. They're not, they're not dear, I don't think, but no idea. I'd like, because you know what? I'd, I'd only trust myself, you know what I mean? I could, I, you know what I'm like? I'd fucking sit on live and pack my little orders and get loads of sales <laughs> while I'm sat there live, you know what I mean? And stuff. You and, would as well, yeah. Yeah, because so I wouldn't trust anybody else, you know what I mean? I'm doing everything myself. This year, I'm going to make an absolute fucking fortune, cool. yeah, and I'm going to make sure I do it the right way and deserve whatever I get. And if that makes me sound big headed, but you've been around me long enough to know, like, I'm in a position now to feel that way because I'm working hard, and why shouldn't I recognize that? It, it doesn't even make you sound forget it. Observer said that their partner's got all the equipment as well. Oh, so maybe Observer for a DM, maybe for the price. Yeah, I love Observer. Oh, think she's brilliant, isn't she? Yeah, she was getting him. Um, fucking Elsa Frost was screaming for us, reporting us all and all that. But you know what the funniest thing was, babes? I, I seen on the For You page as well. So the Elsa Frost one's reporting us all, saying that she's just going to get rid of all our cons. She, she put screenshots up of all the reports. And yeah. guess who she reported as well, but didn't realise she'd left the screenshot. It Bradley Warner, she'd report. So she was found <laughs> his bestie mate and all that, going, talk to me, son. Oh, I'll put, I'll put Andrew. And she actually reported this video. I can see it says she reported Bradley Warner's video. So why, if she's offering herself as a friend, is she reporting? You know what I mean? It's all to get at me to try and think that I'd be asked that she was like being little pally pallies yeah. my ex I don't give a fuck who she goes around love <laughs> yeah exactly yeah exactly yeah, so it's just funny that, like, you know what I mean? What, what, a, what a silly boy, you know what I mean? To try and link up with my enemies. They're not, they don't give a fuck about you. They give a fuck about trying to do me down, but they're not winning, are they? I'm the one who's winning. I'm the they're one winning, with a thousand. Yeah. yeah, they've tried to bring me down, and I'm the one with the thousands of views, and I will brag. <laughs> <laughs> I made, I made, I made like fucking, on that live yesterday, <laughs> uh, after TikTok took their percentage, I made £547 for four hour live. Wow, that's not bad, is it? And then today I made £350, and that was after TikToks took this. So in the space of two days, I've made a £1,000, do you know what I mean? And, you know, so let let them all talk about me and cry about me and try and report me and do whatever they need to do. Yeah, let's go. 
That's not bad, that. That's uh, Jealous. Yeah. Of all the lions and whatever else has been no, but it's, You know what, that. babes? It's not even necessarily like big, you know, I don't get, I, I do get some big gifts. Like yesterday, I think Tommy gave me a lion, didn't he? But like, oh, yeah, on, Tommy, yeah. on a whole, it's, it's, it's everybody. So it's no individual, I don't have an individual massive gifter. Yeah. I have yeah, a that's good then. Community. Yeah, it's, it's all accumulated by like medium and small ones. That's, that's pretty cool. Yeah, and I'll have to, uh, listen, the thing is, I know my people in my chat, some of them don't even like gifts and I know them.